Hey guys, it's Stas Fitz here, and today I'm going to be making a LPS squishy, and I will be making my avatar. I'm really excited. If you don't know what squishies are, they are these little stress balls that are also collectibles. So you're going to be needing foam, and I just got these supplies from Michael's Craft Store. You'll need a pen, some fabric glue if you want your squishy to be more 3D or add some more detail to glue on pieces of other foam. You'll need fabric paint or you can mix acrylic paint with glue or Mod Podge and it will work pretty well as well. And you'll also need some scissors. So let's get started. You can also find foam at the dollar store or you could order it on eBay for really cheap. So first, you're going to cut out a piece of foam that's as big as you want your squishy to be. I want her mouth, her ears, and her nose to be more three-dimensional. So I'm going to draw them out on a separate piece of foam so that they can be thicker and more three-dimensional. Now I'm going to draw the actual whole face, which includes these little three patches of fur, as well as where I want the eyes to go, and the forehead. Now you're going to cut your design out, and make sure you have a really good pair of scissors for this because cutting foam is pretty hard. Next I'm going to cut out the smaller pieces that I wanted to be 3D, and I'm going to shape them the way that I want them, so make sure that you are kind of carving the foam in a way, and making it round. Now glue it on where you want it with fabric glue. Now I am gluing on the nose. I have made the ear so that it will go onto this base like this. Now I'll just glue them on. Now it is time to start painting. So I am mixing together my paint and Mod Podge if you are using paint instead of fabric paint. Now I am painting the ears. This is what it looks like so far. Now I am painting the muzzle white. Now I'm going to paint both of the eyes white. Now I will paint the lighter blue part of the iris. And now the darker part of the iris. Now I'm going to paint the pupil black and paint on the eyeliner and eyelashes. I went ahead and painted the two white dots in the eyes for the shine with white. And now I'm going to paint the nose with some pink. And now I am finished. This is how it turned out. I'm pretty happy with it. I think it looks really cute. And this is it in comparison to my actual avatar. And now for something that I know a lot of you squishy fans are waiting for, the squishy test. Wow, it's actually pretty squishy. So once again, thank you guys so much for watching. I definitely recommend doing this DIY Littlest Pet Shop Squishy. It was really fun and pretty easy to make, and the end results are so worth it. And it's just a really cute thing to have around in your room. So as I said, thank you guys so much for watching, and bye!